My name's Supreme with Pete. I like to go fishing for creepers. And this is Minecraft Wheatley. And we're here today with the texture pack spotlight. We got XS Sheeps Sheep Pack version 1.3. So let's take a look and see what he's done. Bear in mind this is a work in progress and not everything has been changed yet, but it's looking good. From what I get from the feel of this texture pack, it's taking the original feel of the Minecraft textures and added to it and made it a bit better. So you've got a blue bed here with a little gold trim, that's a really nice touch. The paintings have got creeper heads on them. The glass is how everyone likes it, which is see-through. Doors are nice, the wood's nice. And he's added his own touches to things like cobblestone and furnaces and stone. So what you can see here is his work so far with the texture back. And I've got to say, I'm digging the cobblestone, I'm digging the glass, and I'm digging this texture pack. So, great job, XS Sheep, and I recommend this texture pack. So, links in the description below, and check it out if you like what you see, or if you want to check his latest updates to his texture pack. And this is 1.5 ready as well. He's updated it to 1.5. So... Yeah, check out this texture pack. Now I'm moving on to the map spotlight, and the map today is Bad Weather by Kozash. And once again, this will be linked in the description. And this is an adventure map, so let's check it out. So, you have some signs. You've voyaged across the sea, and you discover an island, you collapse in your bay, your crew is gone. Rules, do not enter the sea, oh dear. <laughs> and you're supposed to play on peaceful, do not destroy or place box unless it's obvious that you're supposed to. So, yeah. I guess you've got to find your crew or escape or something. So the first obvious thing I see is the glass block on the side there, so there's probably a chest in there, so... Having played through the, a bit of this map, I know for sure there's hidden chests, pressure pads, uh, levers, and things like jumping puzzles for you to do on this map. So, I believe a few people have done Let's Plays of this map already, I'm not sure. So, yeah, you can always go and search for those if you want to see more. But, anyway, check out this map. It's Bad Weather by Kozash, it's on the Minecraft forums and there's a link in the description and as much as I hate jumping puzzles this map is pretty damn good so yeah check out this map. Now it's time for this week's Minecraft news so the big news this week is patch 1.5 it's finally here and what did 1.5 bring? Many little things and tweaks to the game but most notably there's weather effects in the game. This includes rain, snow, and thunder. So, and thunder. Also, if it hits a pig, you will get a zombie pig man. But I'm yet to see anything of that yet, but hopefully I will see them soon. I will actually post links to videos that have seen all these weather effects in the description as I have not been able to get any footage myself so check out the videos if you want to see the weather effects and next update there is saplings every type of tree has its own sapling now so no longer will you cut down all the birch or pine trees in your area and never have them be able to be regrown again you can just get the saplings and regrow them now so that is really good and long overdue another update there's stats and achievements I myself covered this the other day so I will link a video to that you can just see me on the video here actually get an achievement right there so that's the appropriate timing other than that we have ladders 
no longer will you be able to have gaps in ladders. And what I mean by that is you have a ladder and a gap and a ladder and a gap just to save yourself wood and making more ladders. But now you can't have that. You have to have ladder on every block you want to go up. But to counteract this, every time you make a ladder now, you get two ladders for the one lot of wood. So it's worked out all good either way and personally I like it better like this so other than this we have a secret update which some people found it's you can get cooked pork if you set a pig on fire and kill it with fire so I've seen a video of this and I will link it so go and check that out and no longer will you have the need to cook meat on the run you can just bring a flint and steel with you and bake the pigs as you go another update I want to talk about is the new video settings we have a GUI scale now so you can have a really small GUI at the bottom or a really big one depending on what you pick in the settings and also there's advanced OpenGL video settings now so if you have a really good graphics card you can turn that on and the final update I'm going to talk about is the powered rail and the deflector rails so basically now you don't need to build minecart boosters you can put some of this new track down and it is shown how to make this in the video I'm going to link in the description so basically it's made with gold instead of iron and it's got um, redstone attached to it and to power the rail you need a redstone torch with redstone to power it so you power the mine track and your minecart will go off on a flat service without having to need to build one of those boosters that everyone builds but reports say is actually doesn't speed you up as much as the old boosters so I think I will keep my old boosters on the game I play on multiplayer for now but yeah it's good they added that in and the detector rails if you go over them they work as a pressure pad so if you if you're going along your mine track and you go over one of these detector rails they will light up any redstone adjacent to it and open doors change switches and you can make some complicated railway junctions with it and, it and that's really cool so check out the videos in the description for links to all the various aspects of the update and that is pretty much it for the minecraft news this week so finally we move on to the channel spotlight and this week's channel is the minecraft workbench or minecraft wb on youtube and this channel has a lot of subscribers and a massive following. This is a massive community and it's this channel is run by Lucklin, as many people will know, and he runs a massive, massive popular server and also many Let's Players have also come from his server. But on his actual channel, he's got a long Let's Play of his own and he was doing solo for a, quite a long time but then he went on to his family adventures which features Mrs Lucklin and little Ethan which, who is his son and they also have special guests on every now and then also he does like update videos when there's a new update and there's quite a lot of content on this channel for you to check out I'm sure most of you already know this channel but this channel definitely deserves a spotlight and it is one of the best uh, Minecraft channels out there and also there is a massive community behind this one channel so go and check it out and support them if you haven't already and that is pretty much it for this week so remember to leave a comment and like and subscribe if you want to support the show and there's a lot of videos to check out this week and links I know but it helped me explain the update and the other links of the texture pack channel and 
map so go and check everything out and that is it so until next time go to the chopper